Hey, this is Mike with TabSite. I'm with you today to introduce how to add images and use the image widget with the new TabSite drag and build system. So here we are in the TabSite manager and uh, we're on the fan page. Hey Coach Fox, we want Tebow. Uh, yes, I'm a T Tim Tebow fan and uh, I'll keep moving on. Uh, so here we are and we have Above us, we have below the drag and build tab, you see the blue bar, which is the image tray. And we currently have two images in there, you can see. And as we populate images, they would go across there. If we hover over an image, it gives us information on that image, of uh, the file name, pixel size, file size, date added, uh, that sort of thing. And uh, with drag and build, uh, we can do a simple drag to upload if we're using Firefox or Chrome, which is up here in the top right, or if we're using Internet Explorer, that's changed out with a upload button. So um, I'm going to quickly drag some images that I have up on my desktop, and um, I'm just going to show you the images that I'm grabbing. So let me bring my file folder over here and there we are and I'm gonna select this categories 520 so I'm left clicking holding dragging and dragging it up to that drag area you see the green light just turned on below that and I'll get a quick dialog box that says it's uploading now if I move this out of the way you will see that um, that image is loading and there it is so I've added images I can use the uh, shift button and load multiple images at once. So I'm just going to grab two of them now and load them up there as well. While that's loading, I'm going to get rid of my file box there. And here we are. So now I've um, loaded more images into my image manager. And uh, they're there and ready for my use. There's two ways to drag images onto your fan page tab that you're creating. You can go over to the image widget, which is the top row in the middle there with a the mountain in the background. And uh, you can simply uh, left click and drag that widget onto your page. And that loads up the add image. Now you see in the um, above me is my image tray. So um, that's where I can get my images. And then within my add image area here, I can make any image that I load a, a linkable one. So if I want to click on it and send it to my website, I could uh, simply enter in a website address here. And that image will then be a link to wherever I want it to go. And now I'm going to grab one of my images from my image tray and let's see let's grab this one I'm gonna drag it down and there it is new image and I hit accept and that image is there and it's gonna bring it in at the size that I loaded it in now I can also um, simply grab my container box and uh, resize that one if I want to um, and make it fit within that area so but the other way to grab an image is simply to go up to your image tray and find an image that you want and simply drag it down onto your page and there we have it Tim Tebow in the flesh and I've added him in there and you'll notice my other image is behind it so I'm doing layering properties now let's see if I wanted to change the layer all I have to do is right click on Tebow and I'm going to get some options. I can edit element and edit element will bring up a dialog box where I could um, do some things, add that URL again, the, the box that we had before, uh, make some changes to my image. I can bring it forward, I can move it back or I could remove it. So I'm going to move it back here and so that way you can see my other image is uh, coming up before it now and um, I have that image there 
Uh, the other way to get to this is to go up here in the top right where your widgets are and then click on the Layers button, which um, changes to the Layers tab. And uh, when you see the Layers tab there, um, these are the images that uh, I've had on the page as I've been playing around with this. And from top to bottom is the layers. So what's at the top of the layers is what's on top. So you see my Your Source for Survey Equipment is on top. That's at the top of my layers. I could simply drag that and I'm going to drag Tebow back up above and he came up above. So that's a basic tutorial real quick on how to add images to your drag and build image tray and then how to use those images and bring them into the tutorial, into the tab. Signing off, this is Mike. With